basically, the way this works is if you have your focal ingredient in the middle, let's say it's white beans, you're trying to build a dish around that. So, typically how I start is I'll say the first thing that comes to mind, I'll say something like bacon. Right? Well, I know bacon or any type of pork product, pancetta, uh, ham, they all go with white beans, right? So then I'll go, okay, well what goes with bacon? That also goes with white beans. So maybe I'll say apple or pear. So apple and pear go with bacon, they also go with white beans. So now the next one that enters the equation, say it's maple syrup. Now maple syrup needs to go with white beans, which it does. It needs to go with apples, which it does. And it needs to go with bacon or pan or ham, which it does. So you keep building this kind of system, what we call bouncing flavors. So basically, you just keep going. Uh, let's throw an oddball one in there. Um, beer, right? So this Guinness go with white beans. Sure, everybody drinks beer with their pork and beans, right? Does beer go with maple syrup? Absolutely, they make some beer with maple syrup. Does beer go with apples? Well, of course you can drink beer with apples. And does beer go with bacon? Well, everything goes with bacon. So, of course beer goes with bacon. So you keep going like this and you build, you build the flavors this way and you just keep bouncing them off each other. Beer and almonds? Yeah, when you're sitting at the bar, you eat salted almonds. Almonds with bacon? Sure. The only rule to this is that, starting with the focal ingredient, whatever supporting component that you put in the puzzle has to go with every other one. Let's say instead of beer, we would have went with red wine. Okay, I can see red wine going with beans. I can't really see red wine going with maple syrup. Red wine could go with apples, red wine certainly goes with pork products, and red wine could go with almonds, but it doesn't go with the maple syrup, so it can't be in the equation. And that's why we went with beer, as long as they follow the rule.